All right, so here is the oscillating water column on its wooden um, lift structure with a handle so you can um, lift it up and down. Um, so we're essentially uh, simulating, basically instead of simulating waves fluctuating uh, inside the column, we are moving the column. Either way, um, air is being displaced out the top um, of the tube and then being sucked back in through the top of the tube. Here is our microcontroller wired up to the generator, which is right here. Baby, baby generator, right in there, right there. All right, so turbine, um, shaft, skateboard wheels, threaded rod to hold it. Um, kind of a funky sideways view. Okay, there you go. And let's get this bad dog going. So, as you can see, right when we start pumping it, well, not right, but uh, after a few pumps, it gets going. And so, kind of step back, you can see it gets going pretty good. And then what we'll do is we'll go ahead and look at the uh, LCD. So what are we reading now? Okay, went back to 0.83, so let's get it going here. Yeah. All right, so we'll get it going pretty good. There you can see it's gone. Go and look at the uh, LCD screen. All right, 2.9 volts and 33, well, it was 87 milliwatts, but let's get it going again. And so I'm pumping it. I'm going to go ahead and leave it on the uh, LCD. Okay, so we saw it get up to about 50 milliwatts, and uh, so that is the basic functionality of our oscill oscillating water column. And uh, yeah, next video is coming.